Good morning, everyone. So, uh, woke up this morning to find a parking ticket on my truck. And that's kind of weird because I've been parking here probably getting close to 10 years. It's not 10 years yet, I'm not sure how long it is, but it's getting very close to that. I've been parking right here in front of my house every night for the last several years. But, woke up to find this. Parking on a through street between 2 a.m. and 7 a.m. So I looked it up. This isn't a through street. I don't know why they would suddenly give tickets. But not only that, I'm pretty sure everyone on the street got ticketed. And I'm kind of wondering how many of those people are just going to blindly pay this fine. I mean, it's like 23 bucks but we have three of them alone because my sister's staying here as well from the Yukon and she got a parking ticket across the road. So I'm going to go down to City Hall and not pay these. I'm going to see how that goes. But it's just funny. What are they thinking? I don't get it. Anyway, let's go. said there's no way to know when you're parking on a through street because the bylaw is very vague which is just great don't you just love when laws are vague so they can do whatever you want but anyways I did show her the map it's clearly to find that where our road turns from west to east and we're on the west side on the east side of King Street is clearly marked as a through a through highway or whatever but on our side, it's not. And it's clearly marked where the areas that are supposed to be a through street. So it's pretty interesting. And she recommended not to pay the tickets and to go to talk to someone in Hamilton, which I don't know what I'm going to do, but I will do. But I'm not going to pay them. some reason that I don't know why I decided to leave the house and go find somewhere to shoot some photographs and take some time lapses so I guess I should go do that not gonna be out long gotta get back way too tired I never get tired of this view. Crap. They're raising the drawbridge right now. I just turned off my time lapse. I can't. Oh, it's already up. 
I'm just gonna cut it into the time lapse and you're not even gonna know. Okay, so that was a cool time lapse. I know I'm gonna be too tired to do this when I get home, so I'm gonna do it now. The end of the video. So what happened today with that ticket? Apparently uh, I had to go. I would have to go to Hamilton or something, fight it, or whatever. But I guess some of our neighbors called, complained about it, and they're just scrapping their tickets and. The, everyone's just gonna call and that's just what's gonna happen like I thought was gonna happen which is great which means I don't have to go into Hamilton waste my time talk to someone argue with someone maybe get a ticket taken away or something they're all gonna go as they should because it is not a through route or a through street or a through highway or whatever they want to call it so I guess that's some good news yeah what else happened today then I did some work and I again stay up way too late and it's way too late right now. So, you know, let's wrap this up. Not much to talk about and I am so tired. I'm gonna have to do an early story tomorrow. So let's do that. All right, be good, good night. Check out this parking. I won't park beside him. Not today.